Do you win all or almost all of your Wordle hands? Are you looking to improve the difficulty of the Wordle hands you play, but you don't want to get ridiculous? In this broadcast, we'll examine the seven levels of Wordle play, ranging from introductory to truly diabolical. Hey guys, I'm Mary Schaefer from AP Now with another talk to help you hone your Wordle skills. And today we're going to talk about the different levels of Wordle play. We're going to start off with the introductory level. Um, it's kind of the place where we all start. And this is where you use the same study word um, every day that you play. And it gives you, as you know, uh, six chances to guess one five-letter word. Okay. Next level is what I call the basic level, um, and this is kind of similar to the introductory level, except you vary your starting words, but you va vary them according to what I call the commonly accepted um, best starting words, so the words that will give you the best chance of winning the hands and winning them uh, as quickly as possible or in as few as rounds as possible. And what do I consider those words? Stare, S-T-A-R-E, stare, S-T-A-I-R, Crane, C-R-A-N-E, you know who thinks that's a good word, a do, a rise, and a rose. So if you use any of those and you kind of vary them, it'll up your game a little bit and it's kind of fun. Okay, so the next level I want to talk about, um, level three is what I call the intermediate level. And this is where you play Dwardle. Dwardle gives you seven chances to guess um, two five-letter words. So basically, you're playing two hands at the same time. Eh, kind of fun, okay? And now the next level is the advanced level. And this level is where you use a different starting word um, that doesn't always re rec rely on those recognized best words, which I've already mentioned. How hard you make this level will depend on what you choose as your starting word. So for example, um, some of my colleagues and friends, they'll use words like grace or money, um, something like that, and they'll, they'll start the game with that. It doesn't give them as um, good a chance to win quickly as some of the generally accepted words, but you know, they, they, they deal with it and they know how to play with it. Um, and so that's what I call the advanced level. Um, before I tell you how to play some of the more difficult levels, um, I'd like to invite you to hit the uh, the like button or the subscribe button. Um, and also just tell you that we post three times a week, Tuesdays and Thursdays, we post about accounts payable and payment topics. And on Saturday, we post about my newest obsession, Wordle. We've got about, uh, I don't know, 15 or more Wordle videos. Um, I invite you to take a look at them. Okay, so moving on now. Uh, we're going to talk about the hard level. And this is where you play Wordle at what uh, the New York Times calls uh, the hard level. And, and Josh Wordle also, I believe, was when he had the uh, invented the game and put it up. There was the hard level also. We've got a video on that. There'll be a link to it in the show notes below. Okay, the next level. Okay, now we're really moving on. The next level, which is what I call the difficult level show for some reason. Okay. The difficult level is where you play Quartal. Now, Quartal gives you eight chances to guess four words. It's a lot more difficult. I can tell you that much. Um, I've tried it a few times myself. Um, it's kind of fun if you have a little bit of time, but you really have to make the, um, the you know, the old brain uh, work, if you will. Um, we've got a video on how to play Quartal and some tips on, on how you can um, not immediately lose, which is something that's happened to me. Um, and again, that will be down in the show notes. And finally, we've got the diabolical. Um, this is where you play what's called Orctortal. And this gives you 13 chances to guess uh, to play, you play eight hands to guess eight five letter words. Now I've tried it once or twice. It makes me nuts. I can't, I, I can't keep up with it. But if you're up, up for a challenge one afternoon, you might want to try Octordal. Okay. So what level do you play at? I'm going to be honest. I usually play at one of the beginning levels. Occasionally I'll start with, you know, a fancy word like grace or, or money. Um, and sometimes I play at the hard level. Um, it's not as difficult as you see as it might seem, but it does make you think. 
Do you want to up your game? Are you looking to try at the hard or quarter level? I bet you can do both of them. We've got videos to on um, both that you can watch um, right now if you want to get started. We'll have links to them both in the show notes below. Um, and on YouTube, we'll have the, the links should appear on the screen. As always, we appreciate those thumbs up, those shares, your comments, and your likes. Good luck and happy wordling.